guys, it's massive. <laughs> you definitely feel like it was worth the money. It's heavy, you guys. And this rose, light rose pink color. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty and it's making me so happy. <laughs> oh gosh. First thoughts for sure, it's really heavy. It's really heavy and it's really pretty. Oh, and look at that blue. It's like a texture, kind of like a suede feel. Christian Standard. I never had this translation. Okay, so I've had my journaling Bible for about almost two weeks now and you guys i must say i love it um but i knew i was going to really enjoy it um my first impressions are still the same the bible is hefty y'all <laughs> it really has some weight on it like um you really wouldn't I wouldn't suggest carrying it around everywhere. It is a journaling Bible and I absolutely adore it. My thing is that anything that would make it um, more of an experience for me to spend time in the Word, I'm all for. Right now I'm part way through my day and I am just going to grab my Bible and my little basket full of goodies to journal with and I'm just going to spend a couple of minutes, probably about 15-20 minutes or so, just kind of um, quickly journaling, getting some color on the page, that type of thing. So I have really enjoyed it. It's right here. And all my little goodies over here. Anyway, do you guys Bible journal? I know I've done one or two videos on this channel about my Bible journaling, but I always wish I'd do more of it because it's such a wonderful way to spend time in the Word and to really um, see how God is knitting your story all together. I just really... I really enjoy it. I watched a few review videos that I thought were completely um, thorough and really helpful if you wanted something longer and more of an, you know, extensive review of the Bible because that that is not what this is. This is just my first impressions. I was super excited getting it, so I thought I would share. So I'll leave those videos so you can see a more extensive review on how it responds to different inks and different paints and things like that. But um, for me, I did do a couple of entries. I don't like calling them entries, but I did spend um, probably maybe four or five sessions or so just kind of um, painting and getting used to the margins and things like that. And I just love it. I love that it has so much space there to be able to write notes and um, journal and put some paint on the pages and use some color and add some color and stickers or whatever you want to do with it. My hair is all curled, y'all. I'm not for all the super big curls, so I hope it drops a little bit, but anyway, that's not what this is about. This is about my Bible. Okay, so I put a little bit of color on the page and used a little bit of the ephemera from Illustrated Faith. Then I studied a little bit in Jane, and then a little bit more in Second Peter. What I also used is this. I'll put the name of it somewhere around here because um, apparently I'm forgetting the names of everything today, <laughs> but, um, I just opened this up. This has been really helpful for carrying a bit of my supplies. I've got some stamps here, some glitter, some paper clips, a bit of my Illustrated Faith goodies. My date stamp is here. A little bit of washi. This cute little bag holds my Faber-Castell's gelato. These are pretty pricey, you guys, but they've lasted me for quite some time and I, I enjoy using them. And then inside, I've just got some pins, a paintbrush, some stickers. Down here, I have more of my Illustrated Faith goodies and other stickers and things. I don't have too much. I try to keep it quite simple. The goal is really just for me to put my hands to something while I spend time meditating on whatever it is that I'm reading. So yeah, I am loving my time with my new Bible. Anything that I can do to make that time that I spend in the Word a little bit more special um, is a go for me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me know, do you guys Bible journal? Do you use a journaling Bible? And if so, what are some of your favorite ways to Bible journal? Um, I absolutely love this Bible and it 
it's super special to me. I've been following um, Shauna from Illustrated Faith for quite some time now, and I love knowing that it was part of, that this was something that was part of a vision that God had given her. And I'm so obsessed with it and so in love with the vision that he has brought forth through her. And so I love that. So when she came out with this new Bible, I was like, it is gorgeous. I have to get it. You can see all of the little details and um, all of the special things that she included. And it just makes me happy to support by, um, by having as much as I can of what she has created with God's help. So it just really makes me happy. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and I will see you in the next one.